If you are an Elden Ring fan, you're asking yourself, what is really happening with the Elden Ring DLC? After watching the Video Game Awards for about almost three hours and waiting till the very last trailer, just to realize and to see that it was nothing about Elden Ring. So if you're like me, you're a bit disappointed for the most anticipated DLC that anyone can think of. Yes, the God of War got something for free and there were a lot of other games that launched, but nothing about Elden Ring. Don't feel very disappointed because what I'm about to tell you is gonna blow your mind about what is coming for Elden Ring. As we've been waiting for almost two years for that promised DLC, have in mind, from software, along with Yashiro Kitao, they are a very prestigious developing house, meaning that they're really not going to release anything if they don't feel is going to be really good. And that is what I want to talk to you about. The Elden Ring DLC in a interview that was done by a Japanese news outlet about from software in regards to Elden Ring DLC. They asked Yashiro Kitao about what is going on with the Shadow of Earth 3. Where's the development? When are we going to be able to see something about it? His answer was the following. And this is where we got to dive a little bit more and think about what is in between the line. He said that the DLC is moving along nicely but it will take a while before it launched. Now, what happened is that when he said this, it was before the Video Game Awards and a lot, a lot of content creators, a lot of people were like, oh my goodness, we are really going to see something in the Video Game Awards. Now, this is where the funny part is. From Software, like I said, is not going to release something that they don't feel is going to come out. And we probably may be waiting for about one more year till this is really going to happen. Now, by then, is Elden Ring going to be something in the past or is something that you're still going to be playing? I feel the way they build their games, it's for you to enjoy them for a very long time. So whenever they decide within a year or less, this is something that still a lot of you guys are going to be playing because it's something, not only did they sell a lot of copies, over 17 million, trust me, they're not going to say no to all that money. They're not. What they're doing is they're making sure that they're coming with something bigger, something very ambitious, something that only from software can build. And it's the following. On his interview, his second part of his answer was, among other things, it will bring a new battles and characters. We are going to be getting new battles, new characters, now, he went ahead, he says, I compare this next to the Bloodborne's The Old Hunters DLC. If you guys know about this DLC, it was something massive. And that is what From Software is all about. We are about to get probably a DLC as big as the game. So imagine having a DLC as big as the core game. That is something crazy to just even hear about it no other company does this yes got a war got a free dlc probably you'll enjoy it for about an hour two hours from software makes games that you're going to remember forever and it's probably going to be a dlc that you're going to be diving in for hundreds and hundreds probably thousands of hours into the game which is something i don't mind waiting a year for if it's going to be that special and knowing from software it is going to be very special so i want to hear from you what do you feel about what i just told you are you okay with waiting for that long if you're going to get this massive type of dlc or you rather want something now let me know in the comment section and i will see you guys on the next video